So in this video we're going to have a look at how to change the aperture, shutter speed and ISO on a Nikon D3100 uh, SLR camera. It's important that you remember to check all your settings on your camera before you actually try and change the aperture, shutter speed and ISO. That means you need to make sure that your camera is on single shot mode, that it's on manual mode on your dial and that it's on manual focus on your lens. To turn on the Nikon camera, all you need to do is to flick the switch across to on, okay, and then you'll see that the screen will then turn on, okay. If the screen either disappears like so, all you need to do is at the top here, click on that info button and you'll see that it comes back up. In order to change our shutter speed, we just need to move this dial here on the top and you'll see that it's changing on the left hand side there. You'll also see that our meter is changing underneath as well as I change shutter speed. And if I want to change the aperture, all I need to do is make sure I am clicking, make sure I'm clicking, holding down this button here whilst also moving the dial. Okay, so you'll see the shutter speed isn't moving and now the aperture uh, f-stop is. In order to change the ISO setting, all we need to do is click on this little information button on the bottom left hand side and you'll see that we'll be able to change through the different settings and all you need to do is click on to the ISO setting Okay, and then your, the ISO sensitivity screen will come up and you'll be able to choose which one you want to depending on your lighting situation. At the moment we'll just leave it on 200 which is good for a sunny day. In order to view um, any photos that you have taken on your camera, all you need to do is click up on the left hand side at the top to the display button and you'll be able to look at any photos that you have taken. And to go back to the information uh, screen, all you need to do is click on the display button again and you'll be able to take photos.